The Nigerian Red Cross says terrorists have killed 41 of its workers in the northeast region between 2016 and 2022, while 20 were wounded and 28 were kidnapped, including five persons abducted in Beno State in the last three months. In Zamfara, one died in the hands of his abductors in 2022, while another was kidnapped in 2023, but regained freedom after days in captivity. The chairman of the Nigerian Red Cross in Zamfara State, represented by Osman Mafara, stated that these are the symposium organized by the organization in commemoration of this year's World Humanitarian Day. Between 2016 and 2022, according to the aid workers, security database, 41 workers had been killed in Northeast Nigeria, while 22 had been wounded and 28 kidnapped only three months ago. Five aid workers were kidnapped in Afar, Benue State. With over 800 volunteers and counting, the Nigerian Red Cross Society continues to work on the front lines providing critical aid. Last year we had uh, one of our volunteers uh, who was uh, kidnapped along other people in their community, but later he lost his life. But uh, this year uh, we also had one of the volunteers, but uh, uh, fortunately for us he was uh, rescued after he was kidnapped. So we thank God. And you see the structure of Red Cross uh, does not uh, make us to work even uh, even though we work all, all over the state, even the, in places where the security is very heightened. But uh, we have community volunteers that are there. Uh, we don't actually move from one place to place. So they were trained. Uh, we conduct a weekly training on basic first aid, health emergencies, and so on. So with that training, they can do a lot of work at the grassroots level. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.